What's up, nerds and nerds? That's what we little nerdlings are. <laughs> Your buddy Big Johnny G from Two Gun Pixie Presents Legendary Gaming is back again. And what do we have here? Something I've been I've been really getting used to doing these. I've really been having so much fun doing them. It's not particularly game related. It's one of the things. Actually, I think it's the only thing I do in this web channel that isn't actually game related, though it is highly, highly nerdly motivated. And that is an unboxing of Loot Crate. <laughs> now, every month you get the Loot Crate box. Every month it's it's a different shape. That's something I've been noticing, that uh, there's no universal size to the box. And that's usually because the boxes become something. Um, they're able to be uh, redesigned, so to speak. They're designed to be redesigned into other cool nerdy things like a dinosaur, or a robot, a comic book holder. So that's really cool. That's why these things are always slightly differently shaped. But why don't we check out and see what July 2017 is coming from Loot Crate. All right, so as usual, you've been watching these. You know, I can't do any unboxing at all without my main man, Fu Manchu, because he holds the blade. Thank you very much, Fu. Get this nice, ready to go. Remember, always cut away from yourself. And if you don't cut away from yourself, you didn't learn it from me. You learned it from someone else. All right. As always, I will let you all take the first glance before I even look to see what's in it. All right. So that's why you're going to see like weird stuff in the inside of the box because it always designs into something. Ha <laughs> ha. I'm not looking yet. I'm not looking yet. Is this good? I would say it's always good. So this is the base box for Loot Crate. It cost me, I think, 20 bucks a month. And. <laughs> oh, Burger. Bob's Burger. Bob's Burger of the day. The Loot. Great exclusive burger. <laughs> so this month's theme, every month there's a theme. This month's theme is animation. Now in these boxes alone, you always get a t-shirt. And I'm telling you, these t-shirts alone are probably the worth the price of the box. So this one, it's green, it's mutant, it's a ninja, and it's a turtle. All right, I'm a big boy, so I get a big shirt. Here we go. Here goes Michelangelo, Leonardo, Raphael, who, uh, 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 who am I missing? My God, what's happening to me? You got Michelangelo, you got Leonardo, you got uh, Raphael, and Donatello. Donatello. Wow, it's been a while. Remember, I, I'm from the 80s style uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Actually, I'm from the original black and white comic book, which was... Much more adult and bloody and violent than the cartoons ever were. But no, this looks really cool. It looks really cool. Turtle mobile. Got them all in there driving. I think this looks pretty cool. I guess these are little uh, turtle shell designs, right? Right? That's kind of cool. Let's see. All right, put that off to the side. You already saw this, so I might as well pull it out. This is some sort of... It's Rick and Morty. All right, let's see what this Rick and Morty thing actually is. Here we go. Let's see. Explicit contents. What is this? A Rick Peace Among Worlds. This is for ages 18 and up. Specifically, this is from Season 2, Episode 6. For those of you that are fans of the show, and I usually don't do, uh, I don't take these things out of boxes, but I don't even know what this is. So let's take this out of the box. Ho, 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 ho. Let's, <laughs> Too cool. And it coincides with the new season that's starting up uh, of Rick and Morty. Hit show. Uh, one of the top rated shows on Adult Swim right now. Totally, totally love it. Looking forward to maybe getting the crypto. Uh, uh, Cryptos uh, has a board game on, uh, on Mr. Me Seek. I should really get that. That was one of my favorite episodes. All right, that is really cool. 
All right. That's, uh, <laughs> I know my wife, my friend Mink, huge fans of Bob's Burger. This is the Bob's Burger Burger Box. Got the family on the back. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. I know, I know, I know. Go back to Foo. Get the blade again. I know, you all want to see this. So let's take a look. Let's open this up and see exactly what is the Bob's Burger Burger Box. Hmm. It's like Christmas, you know, shaking the box before you... Real recipes for joke burgers. <laughs> oh no, once my wife sees this, I wonder what I'm gonna have for dinner tonight. Okay, and I'm not implying because my, she's my wife that she has to cook the meals. This is the way it's happened to be working out tonight. There we go, this should be good enough. Yeah, you wanna take a look at this, don't you? You wanna see what craziness this is. It's almost like a little, little book in card form. So, how to cook a basic burger best, because I guess you should really know how to cook a basic burger before you start trying anything else, right? So it's from Season 1, Episode 1, which was entitled Human Flesh, the New Baconings Burger. Pablano Picasso Burger. Anything on the back? Oh, there's pictures in the back. Okay. The Do the Brussel Burger. Yeah, they all have these little pictures in the back, too. Oh, this is two of them. This is two of them. That's the Brussel Burger. Do the Brussel. Do the Brussel. Dun, 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 dun. Pickle My Funny Bone Burger. That's, that's what that is for. Mink, are you watching this? If not, you better. I know you subscribed. Oh, this is this is pretty good. Yeah, it shows it. I feel like I'm playing the old arcade game Burger Time. This is the Bet It All on Black Garlic Burger, baby. Yeah. So I'm not gonna sit here and show them all off, but there you go. They all. That is, I think, really, really pretty cool. And I wonder what's gonna be on the menu for the next few weeks. All righty then. Got something from Future Rommer. Oh, these look like. No, don't even need the blade. These look like beer cozies. Beer tits, so to speak, for your cans. Yep. Because, you know, everyone needs some slurp in their life. You got two of them, so you and your buddy can be drinking together. But so what else? What is this card that came in? Oh, it's just a koozie. Just. Well, that just tells you what it is, a koozie, two-pack. All right. Well, there's always an exclusive, always an exclusive pin that comes with every one of these boxes. And this one, it's Bob's Burger Pin. Look at Gene. Outside, wearing the burger, advertising for the family, get some business up. <laughs> All right, love me some Gene. That's a great show. And okay, we all, every, everyone always comes with a book, tells you everything you need to know about all the products that are in each of the boxes. And this is something special on the animation. Since this is the animation theme, it was like a little, little workbook. All right. And then that's it. So this is probably going to turn into, when you unfold it and refold it, this is probably going to be looking like it's the back of his counter. That's what I'm guessing right now. But that's what I meant earlier at the beginning of this when I said the boxes are all different shapes because they all do something. They all become something. They all get redesigned. All right. If, you, uh, if you're watching this and you get Loot Crate, why don't you post a picture of your box after you've done doing it and why don't you show us how your boxes come out and we'll compare them all. All right. So for Two Gun Pixie Presents Legendary Gaming, I am Big Johnny G. This has been an unboxing of the July 2017 Loot Crate Box. And I am out of here.